Welcome to this video on inserting a hyperlink into a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. So I have some data on my screen and I want a link in there to be able to, for people to be able to go and navigate to either another worksheet, a website, another part of my system, maybe a chart or anything else. And I can do that very simply by inserting a link into my spreadsheet. So you can either select an empty cell or you can select a cell like me that's already got some words in it. Don't worry if you don't put those in, then you can do that when you're creating your hyperlink or your link out to something else. So when I've selected my cell, you can see I'm selected. I'm gonna to go to the insert tab on the ribbon. And then what I wanna do is usually towards the right hand side, you've got the link option and I'm gonna select that link option. Now I'm using a MacBook, so yours might look a little bit different here. Um, but you've got a number of different things and it's exactly the same functionality. Just this box looks a tiny bit different if you're on a PC. You can get it to a web page or a file. You can do it to another place in this document. If I click on that, you can see I've got references and all sorts of stuff, defined names, or you can even link out to an email address if you want to do that. If you want to get someone to send you an email or get someone to use that link to start an email process going. I'm going to do a link to my YouTube channel so I can neither get to the YouTube channel directly from the spreadsheet. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy and paste that YouTube channel information. It's much better to copy and paste it rather than to type it in manually because you're likely to get it wrong, especially if it's a long one. So let me just grab that and I'm going to paste it in there. And then I'm going to click on OK. So what you can see now, and I'll zoom in, is I've got my text there. It's in blue, it's underlined, and it's now, if I hover over it, you can see, I can see a little hand, and it's gonna take me to my YouTube channel. If I want to make any changes to it, I would just make sure I've selected that cell, and I go back onto the link option. Now, something I didn't mention before, right at the top, you've got the text to display there. So if I hadn't have written that in previously, I can go in and do that. And I can also take out words that I don't need and it will just change the text that's displayed on the screen. And obviously if I've done anything wrong with the address or I want to link to something else, then I can go in and I can make changes and I can also remove that link in the bottom left hand corner of my pop up box. You've got the exact same functionality if you're working on a PC, but your box will look a tiny bit different. So I'm going to click on OK and you can see the title, the visible text has now changed, but that link is still there and available for me. So super quick and easy to do. Please do have a go. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and let me know what videos you'd like me to record next.